All right, so anyway, I saw this on uh, uh, Amazon, and I saw it on, I think, Instagram, a couple other places, and it's at like $21. And if you got some old hard drives and you want to be able to read them, supposedly this will work. So it's for uh, 2.5 inch and 3.5 inch. So if you got some laptop uh, hard drives or some, you know, a workstation hard drives, this is supposed to work. So let's see what's in the box. All right, so anyway, it feels pretty flimsy <laughs> right off the bat. It just feels like a, a piece of plastic, which I do believe it is. But that's it right there. Throw it out on the ground. And um, let's take a look at it. You just open it up, and apparently you just slide it right in there. And there's your uh, your little connectors. And it has a, a USB 3 and your DC 12 volt adapter, which I do believe are somewhere in here. Let's take a look. All right, so here's our, our uh, power source, the power cord. Comes with this kind of power cord, so, you know, not too hard to figure out. And then let's see where, oh, good. It does come with one of these. Let's put that over there. So you'll need this. If you lose this, you're in trouble because <laughs> you can't power it. So let's see if I can get it popped through here. Why do they, you know, they can save money by just not using this plastic. I mean, I don't think it does anything to help the product. But it also comes with um, a um, some directions. So, you know, you can read through here and try to figure out the directions. So that's it, really. I mean, four pieces. The unit, the two cords, and the directions. And then there's this here. You can get a warranty on it if you want. But it's $21. I mean, you could just buy a new one. <laughs> so anyway, we're going to try this bad boy out and see if it works. All right, so anyway, the setup's pretty simple. I mean, you got to plug it into the power source. So you're going to take this. And you're going to put it right into this little hole here. Bam, done. And you got to plug that thing in. And then on the very back of it, you got to hook this bad boy in there. So, first of all, they've got these wire things on here. But you couldn't use, save these because these are, you can always use these things. All right. So, anyway, you got to get the right end in there. So, take a look at it. There it is. Got to shove it in there. That's it. Bam. Now this thing is set up, really. All I gotta do is plug this end into the computer, into the USB port. Plug this into uh, into the uh, a power source. All right. All right, so we're just gonna plug that into a power source. So you can see it comes right over here. We're hooked in. Then I've just gotta get this thing here into the USB port, which on Macs are in the back, which are a pain in the butt. And of course, it's not a USB-C, so you gotta figure out which way it goes in. Now I gotta twist it and it's got torque on it. It's giving me a hassle. There we go. And now we're in. Now everything's in. Now this thing's ready to go. Now all I need to do is get a hard drive and stick it in there. <laughs> and you know what? I think I might have some hard drives down here. Nope. Ah, here we go. Here is a hard drive. This is an old hard drive. I don't even know what's on it, but we can go ahead and try and plug it in and see if it works. All right, so pull it out of the uh, out of its base. This is an old Seagate, and um, let's take a look at it. And you can see here's the keys, and so it's going to go in like this and slide in. So let me push this out of the way, pop this open. And I guess we just got to set it there. Watch this. Let's slide it in. Bam. Done. Now, I guess I hit this. Turns on the light there. You see that? Let me show you. Right here. So anyway, it's in there. I hear something. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the computer. I'm going to come down here, see if it sees it. If I look up here, I should see... 
Oh, right there, look. And that's it. But I don't see anything there on there. It's not, maybe it's reading it right now. Well, it sees it, but it's not seeing this hard drive, which is disappointing. Shall we give it a second or two? Because there might be a lot of stuff on the drive. Nothing coming up yet. I mean, if I go here, I got everything I need on that drive. This drive, not so much. So this is becoming another disappointing purchase off of <laughs> off of uh, Amazon. Not too sure about this bad boy. We'll give it a couple minutes. All right, so if I turn this off, watch. All right, disappear. So I'm gonna turn it on. So I've turned it on. I hear a click and it should show up here. There it is. Now when I click on it, I don't get anything. So it's, you know, it's in there, but it's not reading it. So um, <laughs> I think I'm sending this back too. Just not working the way you want it to work. I can feel it like it's still trying to do something, but and this is on. It's just not, it's just not articulating. Nothing. Nada. All right, let's go ahead and let's kick it out and let's turn it off. And let's pop this open. Now, the question is, can you get this thing out? Look at this. Oh, it's hard to get out of there. So, I don't know, man. I do not know if this is if this is a viable solution for mine. Because I have, if you look here, if you look right here, you see these three pins? It shows this part here, but these don't aren't connecting with anything inside there. I don't see any connection in there for them. So I don't I don't know, I don't think this thing's gonna work. I gotta send it back. Another Amazon product that sucked.